What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Abandoned Land series where we're trying to build a town on the Abandoned Lands map. And episode 28, we're very much on our way. We are over here on the West Side Farm. And if you look in the top right, you'll see that we have $451,000. Now, if we are running a farm, this would be a pretty good amount of money. We'd still need a little bit more, I think, to do everything we wanted to do, but we would be okay. We are running a town, and that is not okay. We need a lot more money because the things that we want to buy, the things that I have to add, we can't do that until we do this task. And that is, of course, selling all of this silage that we mowed up episode after episode after episode. Well, we put it all over here, now it's all silage, and now we can sell it because now we are able to cash in and make some money. That's what we need to do because we have other things that we have to do. Now, the one thing that I forgot to mention as we continue selling this silage is that I have simulated into the spring. So, March 1st is the date and how I've been running this, if you are new to the series, is yes, I do play on the one speed, but it's only because I also only have one day a month, so we've got a lot going on here. There's a lot of things that we have to make happy, a lot of productions, a lot of animals, a lot of just general maintenance around this place, so I'm, that's how I'm going to continue to play it. I'm enjoying it like that, so why change it? But yeah, we're going to have to sell all the silage, guys, and it is a lot. I remember in the playthrough, it took me about an hour to sell all of the silage. So obviously, we're not going to sit here for an hour. This is why I fast forward things. But let me just tell you that it took me a while, and I can't wait to fill it again because we are going to get some money from this one. Now, obviously, we're going to do more than sell silage. So also on the agenda today is to cultivate the field. We're going to cultivate our first field because, as I forgot to mention, I am a terrible host. We are now in spring. I did simulate. It is now March 1st, and we are going to continue playing on the one speed with one day for each month. I think I, I like that better. It seems to work out a little bit better. Our whole focus here is more on building the farm and making the productions run. Not so much a realistic thing because if we were going with a realistic type play, one man wouldn't be building a town, right? But either way, we're gonna sell all of the silage. We're going to cultivate because we have a lot of fields to cultivate. And we're only gonna do one today. The next episode, I think we are going to have a cultivating party because we are going to cultivate a lot of fields in the next episode. But in this one, we're just gonna cultivate that. And then I've got a lot of slurry that I do need to sell up at the, uh, at the cow barn. So money to be made all over here today. Uh, we will not spend any money outside of gas on cultivating. So it's a very money positive day today. All right, and now because we have better things to do today, I am going to put the last bin of silage in here to sell. We are at $1.3 million, which seems like a lot until you look at how many how many dollars these buildings cost? How many dollars these production facilities cost? They are quite a bit. But again, I think that we are pretty close to earning a good amount of money for our town because we have already set everything up in motion. Now we just have to wait. And speaking of waiting, we are going to see how much, but it's gonna be about 1.3, 1.4 million dollars that we're gonna end up with which is really good. Now let's get into the field and let's do some cultivating. All right, now I mentioned that we are going to have a cultivating party in the next episode because I'm going to get a lot of these fields done. But this one is one big field and this is why it's the only field that we are going to cultivate all episode because this one's gonna take me a while and because we've still got to sell some slurry from the cow barn. so. We need to get this out of the way. This is the big one. This is the one where I would say, ah, oh, let's leave that one until last. So instead of that, instead of putting myself through agony, I am just going to get it over with now. And this field's big. So we are going to get to some comments. But before 
I do that. I just wanted to thank you guys for all the support, especially with the role play series, the brewery, which if you haven't heard, I am ending it. So I am researching another story right now. I just felt like the brewery needed to end when they opened it mostly because it's really hard to simulate a lot of things that go into running a brewery with farm simulator so i think it ran its course and i'm really happy with how it came out so we're just gonna leave it at that and go to the next role play series and this one i hope actually has some longevity this one i hope will be able to go more on a consistent pace my life right now is crazy so it's hard to edit these things and make sure that they get out every week with the quality that i want so it will probably be every other week but i am going to take the month of march to get everything sorted with the role play i'll still do the abandoned land series and in fact i want to get another series started here in the next couple weeks as well so look for that but Yes, uh, thank you guys so much for the role play series. I appreciate it. And now I'll stop talking and get to what you guys had to say. DJ Big Mac, thanks, Herd, for another great episode. Did you know that grass is older than mummies? And to keep your lawn healthy, you should switch the directions you mow each week? Neither did I until I looked it up. All right, well, DJ, thank you, man. I appreciate it. And very appropriate for the grass tip um, for two reasons. One, because we're in Grassville. And two, because I was outside working with just a t-shirt on today, which was absolutely incredible. Probably next week where I'm at, we're going to get dumped with a bunch of snow. But let me just say that it felt good today. And the grass tip, I look forward to using these, these summer, this summer because uh, I'm ready for it. I'm, I'm done with this winter. But DJ, thank you. And yes, you did uh, have the first comment. I really appreciate all the support. And you have been on you have been on the ball, man. I appreciate that. So thank you. All right, L Family Gaming Dad, great episode. Keep it up. I appreciate it, buddy. Uh, guys, if you haven't gotten over to L Family Gaming Dad's channel yet, please get over there. Check it out. He has great content, uh, and you know, always here to help. Thank you. I really appreciate everything, and I will definitely uh, have to catch up on your channel as well. Let, look at this. I cannot get this cultivator up this part of this hill you know i really do feel like uh during l family gaming dad's comment we have got some problems I feel like that's fitting i feel like that's fitting either way just joking but either way uh let's get this going here there we go l family gaming dad thank you i appreciate it we will move on all right, Auto Sim Crew, great job getting your video out in time, even after a full day's of work. I think I'm to the point where I give up trying to keep a schedule and just get to it when I can. Yeah, listen, it is uh, it is hectic right now in my life. That is for sure. 15 hours of work and then doing one of these, uh, I was ready to go to bed immediately after. Let me tell you that. But uh, yeah, I, I do want to get more of these videos out. But at the end of the day, to be realistic, I want to make sure that the quality is good. And especially with the role plays, uh, that's why I do it every other week. And it's hard to do that uh, at some point. So, um, but, you know, I, I, I do think that just getting the video out with quality is way more important than the consistency, at least for me. And, uh, and I know for you because I've seen your stuff. So appreciate the comment, Otto. Thank you very much. And we will move on to the mayor, Plowboy66. Great video, short and sweet. Have a great weekend, Plowboy. Thank you. I did have a great weekend. I hope you had a great weekend as well. And yeah, short and sweet because we uh, I was very tired. Let me just say that. And now is going to be a couple episodes here. This one and the next one where we are going to have a little bit longer episodes, I would think, because we are going to be cultivating quite a few fields quite a few fields anyway mayor thank you appreciate everything uh and appreciate the comment all right we move on rambo hacker gaming i am way behind on the series glad to be watching this again and now i will have to get back to watching all the videos i missed 
Love the recycling center. I think I missed your building the BGA. Yeah, that was a couple episodes ago for the recycling and BGA, and that was your recommendation, so I appreciate it. I just need to know if I have the right one. I know that you told me to get a modded one, so I'm not really sure if I got the right one or not, but either way, the aesthetics are perfect. Like where I put it, up at the DOT, which is on the east side of this map, the DOT, the first thing that we built, so... It makes sense, all of the civic stuff, or all of the municipalities, I guess is the word I'm looking for, uh, up there on the east side, the west side, which you're looking at over there uh, at about 11 o'clock here. That is the west side farm, so the farms are more on the west, the municipalities are more on the east, and that's because of you, Rambo. Uh, I wouldn't have thought to put that, and I'm glad I did because I can see myself using it quite a bit. So. Appreciate the comment, appreciate the suggestion, and uh, yeah, I appreciate uh, you uh, coming back on board. And guys, get on over to Rambo Hacker Gaming's channel as well. A great content and a, an amazing roleplay series, The Cattle Baron. Check that out. I enjoyed that uh, quite a bit. He's got a bunch more series over there, so check him out um, as soon as this one ends, right? All right, let's get on to the next one. And my guy, that guy that farms, amazing video heard. Those fields were indeed very close together. <laughs> yeah, um, you're talking about the northern uh, expansion, the north part of this map. And I agree, they are very close together. Uh, maybe two feet if I'm being generous with that. With that. So, yeah, I don't know. I was thinking, uh, do I just merge these and just make it into one field? What are we doing here? <laughs> Either way, yeah, thank you. Appreciate all of the support that guy the farms. Thank you so much for everything and thanks for all the suggestions. Again, let me know if we're missing anything because you want anything, I'm gonna add it for you. Uh, either way, thank you, appreciate everything and now we'll move on. And Todd coming in, great video. Thanks for making it after such a long day. Yeah, Todd, actually, I think I talked to you that day on lunch uh, on if I can't remember, uh, Owl Family Gaming uh, Dad's live stream, I believe, that he did, uh, well, at least for me, my time, around noon. But uh, yeah, Todd, thank you. I appreciate it. That was a long day. Happy to do the recording. I'm always happy to do the recording. The problem is playing. I can never find enough time to play this game. And that's kind of where we're at but i do uh, appreciate the comment and as always you have anything that i need to add please let me know All right and last but not least violet pixie i think you should add uh i think you should at some point add the tree farm plus wood planks they make some decent money okay i am writing that down tree farm plus wood planks decent money that is what we need and you have definitely help this series out so i really pre appreciate it violet pixie thank you keep them coming keep the suggestions coming and i will keep fulfilling them because again i tell you guys all the time i can do this all the time i can keep going forever but it's really fun when i get the suggestions because honestly that one i don't know if i would have done and now i'm happy to try it so thank you i really appreciate it and thanks for all of your support throughout this whole series violet uh appreciate everything and now in the smoothest transition on this channel, this side of a role play video, we are in the slurry tank truck and we are headed up to the cow farm, which is right there at about one to two o'clock. And we are going to grab some slurry. We are going to bring it down to the west side farm where we just sold all of that silage. We're gonna sell slurry there as well. And it's gonna help out because we don't have a tank, a big tank, so we are going to have to continue doing this, but the good news is that we are going to get paid every time that we do this. So that is where we are going to end because we are not going to put a production in yet. I want to sit there with that money. I really want to think about it because I do know that there are a couple things outside of what you guys have recommended that I would like to put in as well for the, uh, the, the, the sake of the map, I guess, uh, or at least the sake of me organizing everything. We have outgrown the west side farm and i do want to put in an actual municipal area for all of our equipment uh we'll call it a town hall or a town office or something like that with equipment in the back and the town garage that kind of stuff because 
we've outgrown this farm down here. I can't keep parking things on the side and have it be realistic. So that's coming up in the next few episodes. Not in the next two, but in the next few. So on that, I would like to say thank you very much. Appreciate everything. I really do appreciate you guys hanging out with me and building this farm with me or this this town, I guess, with me. This has been the best uh, town build that I've done, and I've done several. So I really do thank you guys and credit you guys quite a bit for this. You guys give me the suggestions, and I'm just the one that just fulfills everything. So I appreciate it. And finally, the last time, thank you very much for hanging out. I'll catch you in the next one.